Now, a solar power surge is transforming Pakistan's energy landscape. Millions of citizens are abandoning the unreliable national grid in favor of cleaner, cheaper power. But this solar surge has shocked the government. Well, rooftop panels are now a common sight across the country. Pakistan's solar contribution to the national energy mix stood at just 2% in 2020. Now, that jumped to 10% last year and now stands at a whopping 24% in the first five months of 2025, making it the country's largest energy source for the first time ever. It is difficult for the poor to install a solar system, but it makes life easier. But it is a hard choice for people like us, because how can we arrange this amount? It is difficult to arrange money for it, but we have to make this difficult decision due to our needs. As solar power continues to grow, Pakistan is unexpectedly accelerating towards its target of 60% renewable energy by 2030. The customer base of National Grid is shrinking in response and the policymakers are scrambling to curb solar surge. Now, the government of Pakistan has decided to tax the solar revolution in the country and has planned to impose 10% duty on imported equipment. Pakistan is already under $8 billion in energy debt. It's also locked into expensive contracts with power producers and relies heavily on imported gas sold at a loss. The country now faces a new challenge of how to save national grid while incorporating renewable energy options.